There's so much going on at BCIT every day. With over 45,000 students and 2,600 employees across our five campuses, we don't always get a chance to see the innovative and exciting work of our peers. In this video series, we take a peek inside some of the accomplishments of our BCIT community. Hi everyone, today we're talking to Laura Vale, Senior Director of BCIT's Student Success Team. The Student Success Team is critical, as you all know, in providing resources and services to ensure students are well supported during their educational journey at BCIT. Laura, if someone in our BCIT community believes that a BCIT student may be struggling, what can they do to support that student? I would really recommend approaching the student in an authentic and genuine way and just offer support and a listening ear. Put in an early assist so that we can reach out to the student and see what their needs are. I would also really recommend to everyone across campus to be really proactive in how we support students. So think about embedding some of those resources like early assist or counseling in orientation materials, in a welcome email before students start classes. It's a good primer for us. Yeah, absolutely. Laura, can you tell us a bit about some of the ways BCIT supports students' well-being? Sure, so we work under the Student Wellbeing and Resilience Framework, which we've had for a couple years here at BCIT. And in that, we talk about eight dimensions of well-being because we know that there's not just one quick fix for students. They really need that well-rounded support in order to be successful. So we have counseling and student development, accessibility services, our awesome rec services team. There's really something for, for everybody. One of the many Burnaby Campus projects that I'm personally excited about is the Mass Timber Student mm -hmm. Housing Project. How will that benefit our students? Yeah, I'm so excited about that, as I know you are as well. And in, in that project, we're looking to more than double our housing opportunities for students. And, and new with this building is we're actually offering studio units for, for students alongside private bedrooms and communal. And we're really hoping that in particular, our Indigenous learners see themselves at home in, in this new building. We're working with Indigenous initiatives to pursue Indigenous naming of the building, looking at Indigenous planting in the landscaping and so really excited about making this inviting for, for the whole community. It's great, and the plans look awesome. Thank you, though, for all the work that you're doing, uh, Laura, in terms of your team and what you do to support students. I really appreciate all that you've done. Thanks, Kathy. Thanks. Early Assist is a great place to refer students who may be struggling or maybe have questions. It's also important to be proactive in our approaches to student well-being. How is well-being embedded in your services, in your course, in your program, or in your policies? We have great resources in our Student Well-Being Toolkit for instructors, linked to On The Loop. We also offer a variety of on-demand workshops for all groups, students, instructors, departments. Contact our Health Promotion Strategist to book. 